that yesterday i will say it until the day that i die no matter what happens they always talk about offense 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 nerf defense nerf defense nerf defense the, like they, they talk about the offensive nerfs but the amount of defensive nerfs that have happened in this game and i understand like i said it bothers me but i understand why the game has to be that way because people have to be able to score oh, we Still murky, come on. We'll never lose. Good morning, I did 2K land, man. Check this out. We're gonna start the video off the same way we start off every video with the Noti Gang Wall of Fame, and we just gonna go from there, man. Check it out. And he says the countdown begins. Uh, ready to mess up my first bill <laughs> tip <laughs> hey if you're rocking with your boy you're not gonna mess up that first bill man between me and brute we got you hey what up easy hey we are going to keep showing up and showing out y'all did show up and show out on that video I got 827 likes on that video we almost got 10,000 views it was at 9.7 the last time i think we are going to actually eclipse 10,000. and if y'all keep doing what y'all are doing then we gonna do that. So let's see if we can get to a thousand likes today, man. Let's keep running it up and running it out, man. Hey, my guy says 100K on the way. Yeah, you know, been rocking with my boy with the people's champ, man. Hey, I appreciate all of that, man. And then, hey, last but not least, my guy said, didn't know you were a network engineer. What are some tips for somebody trying to get in the door? Trying to get your foot in the door, like I told him, get a job, take a good job, learn everything you can about that job, and, and then learn some things that they can do better, apply that and take it on to your next job. Everything that I've learned in my career, I, I've done regular help desk, took that on to a phone help desk, took the phone on, then I started working for a, a networking networking help desk. Then I worked, started working for an MSP where I had to be the guy. Uh, and then I had to know everything. And that took all of my skills. And because of that, I was able to get this job where I am now. When this company moved, they were like, no, we want to keep him because he's the guy with all the knowledge and he does, he knows the phones, he knows the network, he knows our PCs, all of that. So learn everything that you can, man, and then take that somewhere where they really appreciate you. Also, we're going to uh, check it out. Check it out. Uh, 718 says, man, it's nice to see that someone in the creator community that has similar views on the game definitely feel like your perspectives aren't well represented in the community. I'd also like to play that game with the realism great vid hope you guys i hope you find uh success in 24 we will man as long as y'all keep running that like button and running it up last but not least we're gonna read what the ice man if y'all get that if y'all get that the ice man then you know hey put it down in the comment what's that from but anyway he says the problem the problem is that 2k has always had the more popular people that play 2k uh they are good at the video game but know nothing about the game of basketball or have an i have a or have any basketball like you so 2k has to cater to them uh they're good at the video game but dumb at the sport of basketball and i'm not gonna lie to y'all man like that's how it really is um as far as the game goes and we're gonna talk about all that in the video today man but before we get started make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below y'all know we're trying to go to the moon and if nobody told y'all that today, man, I'm y'all my brothers, my sisters, my family love each and every last one of y'all. Now let's get the video started the only way that we know how. Yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Town, coming to you live with another video, man. Check it out. We're going to go from here. Let's, like, like I said, 200 likes in the first 15 100 views gets us where we wants to go it pushes it out to everybody else and then from there you guys got it let's try to get a thousand likes on this video see if we can get the 10k uh views and uh, let's do that on the regular man i appreciate y'all but hey like a fan say i'm making the best of not making it to community today uh still going hard with the uploads but on top of that gonna make the most of this dynamic uh this dynamic and interview the one uh the interview the one going the hardest that was there i'll be asking joe knows all of the biggest uh questions from the outside looking in regarding the builder slashing pro uh pro-am meta predictions post game and just chopping it up with the homie uh, a little bit recording it tonight and the vid will probably be up tomorrow now listen man y'all already know that joe knows is that guy and he goes hard for the community and yeah hey, everything he does you know like if you're gonna listen to somebody about the build or what have you, you might as well uh listen to the innovator of violence and joe knows mr <laughs> joe knows out here busting everybody's ass on the 6 8 and then we can't stop him and he shouldn't be able to do that because we're pro shut the f up shut the f up like hard eight say check out hard eight link now in the description listen if you can't beat him 
then maybe you're doing something wrong or maybe you're not as far along or ahead of him as you thought you were if he can come in there and make a bill and continuously bust y'all ass and y'all can't do nothing about it hey like i said you like it's no way i could go play lebron right now and use some type of move and beat him or or anybody in fifa or anybody in um in in uh what what's the game called um anybody in fifa or what it's, it's a it's a game out that's super hard uh what's that uh soccer cars y'all know what it is i can't think of what it is you can't beat them guys at their games just because you did something i can't go on madden and have a better team and beat you so so if if he's beating you it might be because he's better than you, but I digress, man. Up next, we got that boy, Steezo. I say we got that boy, Steezo. Oh, oh, yeah. Hey, listen, man, this is what he's saying. Uh, somebody, so somebody says, why do they want to take away role players, bro? They are... Uh, they're the best teammates on the game. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. I'm a role player. That's what I do. I come in, I play my role. I play defense. I shoot threes, and that's what I do. And uh, T, uh, uh, ISO, uh, ISO God Sensei says, uh, this is facts. Every good offensive guard needs a good defensive lock. My point is we are all that we all we are all playing roles to a degree. The only hyper the, they only hyper focus the offense, uh, the offense role and not the defensive sacrifice because they worship what they and no they worship him and know that uh they are going to, for a lot about being what bro okay you went all the way left that listen i understand what you're trying to say steve but dang bro listen listen what he's really just trying to say is man people people look at offense and they hyper focus on offense and because that's what everybody complains about nobody cares about defense in this game i said that yesterday i will say it until the day that i die no matter what happens they always talk about offense 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 nerf defense nerf defense nerf defense the, like they, they talk about the offensive nerfs but the amount of defensive nerfs that have happened in this game and i understand like i said it bothers me but i understand why the game has to be that way because people have to be able to score if you can't score nobody's gonna buy the game so <clears throat> it, it is what it is and I, I get it but we gotta be able to stop people too hey uh hit says locks about locks about to be be up for a month until until y'all start complaining like last year, uh, dribblers are so afraid of a balanced game. Now, I'm not going to lie to y'all. The game was not balanced just last year, but the unrealistic steals are what kind of balanced it out. Now, they had the steals in the game to match the fact that nobody could play defense. And, and the fact that nobody could play defense once they took them out is very telling with the game. That's my stance on it. But hey, that boy Yadman says, I only complain about the RNG steals. It's not realistic. Running up and tapping the, uh, tapping the square to get a steal from an elite ball handler isn't real. I want OP defense. At the end of the day, you have to be uh you have to get a bucket to win games now i get what he's saying too and i definitely rock with it i understand i'm, I'm hey listen i got all of that um like i said man if they could have stopped the steals where you tap whether you were at half court and the dude was at the free throw line and he tapped the button and he just run up and get the steal though those, those unrealistic launches and, and things like that those need to be gone out of the game not gonna lie to y'all but some of the things that i was okay with there were some things i was okay with and, and a couple of those things were um when you dribble, 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 and then you finally make a mistake, then I can take the ball. And so once they patched that part, then we weren't able to take the ball at all. And so now you have no fear. No fear. Have no fear. That's where we was at with it, man. So uh, I, that's, that's the part I didn't like. And we knew, and they knew, that if they complained about it enough and 2K tweaked anything, then we weren't going to be able to steal the ball at all. Everybody knew that because it had happened the previous year, and that's where we were with it. So we can't act like we didn't know what was going to happen, but th hey, that, that's just how it goes. I digress. Hey, Tony Laces uh, says, uh, let's see, it will be... It will it will be forever cheese if you can't guard uh this thing with the 99 perimeter D. Look at the speed, look at the speed boost on the six eight. Uh come on man, you are you are my favorite creator, blah blah blah. Uh where's the skill and all that? He says it's not unguardable, you're just poo and calling it no skill and cheese helps you cope with being poo. So I mean, yeah, that's how that's how a lot of people feel, man. Like you can't you can't guard the stuff. Listen. You can defend just about everything in this game. Big body screens, you haven't been able to really defend in any 2K, those big bodies. And then the other thing is you really haven't been able to defend in 2K, in any 2K is the left, right. And, uh, but this one, you can you can actually do a good job. It's the Westbrook that kills me in this game. I'm not worried about people dribbling and stuff. Only thing I worry about is when he finally makes a mistake, I can't take the ball. And then 
and then uh, Westbrook. And that's why they mad that, uh, but but like I said, this builder, this builder this year, I don't know how it's gonna be. We're gonna talk about that in a second. Hey, Cole, the man says, hey, I hope this court is actually, uh, this court actually gets played on. It looks better than both affiliation parks. I've been campaigning for guys to run their, to run their um, wagers and stuff on these courts the entire time but they won't do it i don't know why they won't do it i don't know what's going on make sure y'all like the video we got to get the 200 likes in the first 1500 to, to to get the video off the ground man let's get to a thousand likes today y'all did 800 yesterday let's get to a thousand but anyway um i've been campaigning for people to play on these courts because i want you know the wager should be on these courts they should be out in the open come up there run the wager and then you can just keep running it back and back and back and you don't have to worry about people getting on the court and losing the court and losing the spot but the reason that it probably won't ever happen is everybody knows that the stage is on extra fucking rookie and that's the easiest place to play so so that's why they play in the stage they don't play in the stage because of the court so this or that or the ambiance in there it's because it's on extra goddamn rookie and they they want to play the easiest way and and pawn it off the skill that's that's what that is man uh up next hey we got boomy up here man with this right here check this out it's too funny my family when 2k dropped we text you you ain't text back no no you didn't call back no no dm back no email back no send a smoke <laughs> sniggle back no sent the letter in the bottle back no hey why you got that back air bounce going man and don't the usos got the most perfect teeth that you ever seen in the history of teeth boy i ain't gonna lie what well, the boy got them for me it is what it is last but not least man what we wanted to talk about today was have 2k gone too far i'm not gonna lie to y'all man i thought that they had gone a little too far with the builder because i kept seeing bills out there that were complete and utter ass i'm not even gonna lie to you they was just complete and utter dog shit. and and it's like i was like how much of this is the builder and how much of this is the bld or the person that's actually building it so and i and i thought about it and i said bro everybody but everybody's bill was trash so i was like i don't know can you make it but then i see the the the, the i saw the the um the two and let me know if y'all thought the same thing and then but then i saw the the bills that two create created the ones where they made the um the uh, the replica bills and those bills were pretty straight they were pretty decent and i started to put two and five together and get seven and i saying to myself man either they went too far or people don't know what they're doing as far as building or the thing is everybody's trying to get 99 something or a couple of 99s in there and when you go into those high 90s you start to your, yeah your overall goes up fast and you don't get anything and that is when that boy tough came i checked this bill out today and my faith is now restored because i was like bro i was talking to t i'm like bro i don't know man they might have went too far t i, I don't know man they're like you can't do nothing you do one thing you can't do nothing else but i'm looking at this bill that tough built man and this is his lockdown bill i would definitely make a couple of changes i'm gonna have an 85 three ball but this is probably as close to very balanced as you can get i'm thinking about tweaking mine and giving my guy a, a very high layup and shot close so when i go in there I can either lay the ball up if I got a step on him or I can pump fake. He goes over and I'm going to have high shot close and I can finish the shot. So I'm thinking about doing that instead of instead of dunking. But he's able to get dunking. This joint got an 82, st uh, a 87, a 72 standing dunk, an 80 dunk. And he got his mid range on 70, free throw on 76, a 78 uh, three ball. So we should be able to get that up. And his passing accuracy is 75. Then he got 80 interior, 94, 96 uh still in, in perimeter defense he got the blocking at 87 because we was like you can you, you can't even make i didn't i was seeing locks out here that can't even get blocked like they weren't able to do anything and it's like and then he got high defensive rebounding as well man so i was i was very worried and then he's got the potential for strength so he got the potential for the strength he's got and, and speed and all of that i'm going six seven and i'm probably going to be like an 86 speed or something like that man or, or we just gonna have to go but it's going to be very telling uh with this and then obviously we saw we saw my boy um we saw my boy king dooms he also put out a build and it was very balanced it's like uh i'm gonna have the links to both of these in the description but he's just like for everybody uh everyone's favorite build so far and he got 87 driving dunk a 75 three ball i'm not rocking with the 75 three ball dooms i don't care what you say you're an elite shooter i'm not i'm going with 85 but uh 92 ball handling and 87 perimeter d and so it seems like as long as you're not going crazily into those 90s on a few things i think you'll be fine so 
I, at first, I was like, yo, this builder might be tough, man, because I don't know. I think they went too far. I think that, you know what I'm saying? It might be too bad, but it looks like it's pretty balanced. You're just not going to be able to go crazy in several categories. You're just going to have to be mindful of what it is that you really want to do. I really want to play defense. What I'm going to do is this. <clears throat> I'm going to go in, set my jump shot to 85 right off the bat. Whatever I got to do, the lowest stats and, the, and you know what I'm saying? The high stats, lowest stats, whatever you want to say, where I can get 85, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have 85. Right, so once I get the 85 uh, three ball, then I'm gonna set a 70 jump shot, 70 uh, 70 free throw, and then I'm gonna set um, a 70 pass accuracy. Then I'm gonna put up all the defense I can put up. Then I'm gonna see if I can tap that. Then I'm gonna see how much dunking or how much finishing I can get. I'll play with that. Then once I do that, I'll um, I'll either tap the pass accuracy to 70 or 75, something like that, and that's what we're gonna get it at, man. Probably gonna try to get 76, because I think that's what you gotta have to get touch passer, but that's how I plan to make the bill. I'm glad to see that as long as you're not going 99 in several categories, you're gonna be okay. And and like the gates for strength and and uh, all that stuff, man, they really do make a difference. That's one thing that I, the builder seems to be so balanced that if somebody finds a bill that, that defies all gravity in the builder, it's gonna be a problem. And so that's what I'm hoping doesn't happen because if you have, if you have all everybody super balanced and then one outlier that or there's a broken mechanic in the game, it has the potential to make the game just be completely busted by that one mechanic, just like what we had in 2K21 where everybody just went six seven. It was just like whatever. You got three six sevens on the court. There was no reason to do anything else unless you went to the wreck or something, and then it was. But y'all, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Have these two bills kind of restores your faith in the builder did you were you doubting the builder too because i definitely was and i'm gonna holler at y'all next time to the next time make sure y'all like the video let's get to a thousand likes but let's get to 200 in the first uh 1500 it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ Gosh, baby. Gosh, baby.